Okay guys, I'm gonna try something new today. As you can tell with the jacket is also something new. I'm going to try to do a vlog completely unedited and we will see where this goes. <laughs> last I have become an aspiring writer or I should say an aspiring novelist I've always been an aspiring writer but I've never thought that I would actually write a full-length novel and I've definitely never outlined a full full novel and I've never brainstormed a novel I've just never novelized However, now that there's Camp NaNoWriMo, I've been feeling like I could do this. However, I could probably only write a novel with NaNoWriMo because I feel like I wouldn't actually go through with it if there wasn't those incentives like finishing and there wasn't people also doing this crazy idea of writing a novel in a month. And so... I'm going to do Camp NaNoWriMo in July, which kind of sucks because I decided to do um, Vuda instead of um, Camp NaNoWriMo this month. And then on Friday I had an idea for a novel and I outlined it all and I'm so excited for it. I'm really loving the characters so far and I'm fleshing them out and I'm developing them. However, it's going to be three months until I do anything with them, at least to the actual novel. I'm going to be writing blog posts from my characters' perspectives, and I'm really scared that I'm going to get sick of my characters, and I'm going to get sick of my story, and I'm going to think it's a bad idea. And yeah, I don't know exactly... Yeah, you know, you know, this is why I don't do vlogs unedited. But I'm going to do a lot over these next three months with this novel and outlining it in its entirety and making a writing wall over there. And as I said, blogging as my character is not in public. It's going to be on a Word document. But I'm really hoping I'm not going to get sick of it by July. And I'm really excited and I want to write it now, but I know that I'm probably not going to get it done if I, if I don't have anyone to talk about it with. Like, everyone has in NaNoWriMo, they have that group of people telling them, you have to finish this, you have to keep going. Like, so what if it's stupid? Just keep writing. And of course, all of the NaNoWriMo videos that are up this month is not helping the me wanting to get started with my novel problem. But I do think that this is good for me. I'm very happy that I have this idea of a novel to do. Because when I was very deep down in my depression, I was not creative. I wasn't putting up videos. I was not writing anything. I wasn't even reading. But I definitely would not have came up with an idea for a novel when I was at my lowest. And so I'm very happy that I'm obviously getting better if I'm writing and creating things. So I think that's really cool. It's cool that I am excited for this. It's cool that I'm excited about something. I'm excited about life and the possibility of me finishing this novel and editing and having it be good and sending it off to a publisher and the possibility of being able to have a writing career doing something that I love for a career just like these videos kind of give me that I could possibly do something like this for a career because I really really enjoy it and my one goal in life is to keep doing things that I enjoy for money because I need money to live. So I want to get a career in something that I love to do. I love writing and I love words and communicating and storytelling. So I'm excited about the possibility 
of another story to tell. So I will see you guys next time. Hopefully this vlog wasn't too all over the place. And bye. <laughs>